quality suite. Today I'm going to show you on how we can create a back order PO for an order with a group item in it. To get started, we're going to go to our orders. And then we're going to go up here to create new order. I'm just going to select a customer. And I'm going to add my group item, which is this dining room set. Within my dining room set, I have one table, four chairs, one Lazy Susan, and four placemats. Now I'm going to save this order and create it. Now when I'm in my order module, I'm going to click this box show item list. And as you can see in my order 129, I have all of my dining room sets. Now to create a back order PO for this, I can go up here to this checkbox to allow multiple selections. And I can go and grab my dining room set. But I also notice I have another order down below, order 127, that also has another dining room set. So I'm just going to go and add that to my back order PO, since it's going to the same supplier. And then I'm going to hit the three dotted menu and create back order PO. Now what this did is it grabbed my preferred supplier and it added both of the customers, Felix and Carol's orders to my back order PO. It's differentiated by the hyphen and the order number. Once you're satisfied, you're going to hit save. Now my back order has been created. To see that, we're going to go to purchases and go into purchase orders. Now that we're here in the purchase order module, we're going to go and view this purchase order. And as you can see, it's the same purchase order for my two other orders right here, Felix and Carol. And that's how to create a back order PO with multiple orders on it. Thank you.